I think Dragon Blade, the basic is about the piece. I think everybody has the responsibility. Like, I'm the actor and producer. I use my way to make a movie to show the world. And you're the cameraman, you're the reporter, you're the, even you're ordinary people. Everybody should use your own way, different kind of way to tell the world how important is the piece. Andrew Brody, Oscar, you know, he's a, <clears throat> when he's walking on the set just by himself, nobody, nobody got, no assistant, nothing, just a bottle of water, just walking. I said, Jackie, do I need a, a <clears throat> makeup to, 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 to try the costume and everything? I just, I then I tell all my people, look, that's the big star. When you, have a, when you have a confidence, you don't have to show the people, I'm the big star. When the people, they don't have confidence, they have to bring like a 10 bodyguard to, yeah, big star coming in. I said, that's the big star, yeah. I don't want the audience always look at Jackie like, rush hour one, rush hour two, rush hour three, uh, <clears throat> and comedy, action comedy, an action star, comedy star. No, I want to tell the audience, Jackie is a actor. I can do everything. Just like Rob De Niro, I hope. And uh, like Dexter Hoffman, Al Pacino, you know. Multi-talent. You know, I can act, I can fight, I can do a stunt, I, do, I can do a comedy. And all those years, I try to tell the audience, I can play a different role. Yeah, everybody fight each other. I have to protect how the same role, peace. So I have to rely how use my my talent, use my uh, tricks to make the thirty six tribes uh, to unite. For me, I've been making a film fifty four years, all my life in the film film set. As an actor, producer, director, stunt coordinator, for me, so easy. Really, just like a piece of cake. I think the, uh, this movie is not about special stunt, special new trick. I think they will find out uh, the war. When the war starts, how terrible, how violent, how why we have to hurt each other, even though you are Roman, I'm Chinese. You have, you have your family. I have my own family. We don't know each other. Why we fight? Fight for what? At the end, you lost, your, your, your children, your, your family lost you. My family lost me. At the end, we hurt both family. Especially the war, how many fam families get hurt? Fight for what? At the end, probably fight for nothing. Yeah, that's, that's the, I think that it's not about what kind of trick I want to show, what kind of stunt I want to show. It's not this kind of movie. I think Dragon Blade is most about story. I tell the story, how important is, uh, is the piece. I think the piece is action, yeah. I think basic training. I've been training um, when I was seven. I think my foundation is very good. I think talking about punch kicking knife stick, all kind of weapon fighting for me is like really, really is a piece of cake. But these days you tell me jumping and flipping, not anymore. <laughs> not, not easy anymore. And I, I think I know the way how I uh, train myself, how to make myself make, uh, look good, yeah. Based on the true story and about Silk Road, uh, I find out quite interesting. And also, you're talking about, you're making a Silk Road piece, actually, the whole story is tell about the whole world, especially these days, we need a piece. 
and and also I can work with some uh, uh, American actor and I just want to different than some other Chinese movies, some other American movie, a different some my movie. I I always want to find something different. So I think Dragon Play is a kind of one of my the movie I like so far. Mm -hmm. That story is uh, popular. Everybody knows. It, it happened 2,000 years. Uh, even two months, six months ago, I see the, the Roman descending. descending. They don't, 300, they still in China. They blue eyes, golden hair, but speak Mandarin. The, actually, they, they, they grand, 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 grandfather, 2,000 years ago from Roman. Then after they tried to go back, but and, and that time Roman is gone. So they, they decided to stay in Lijiang, Li Chen. Li Chen, and that time the Han, Han, Emperor, Emperor, mm -hmm. Emperor. Then, okay, you guys, because we nobody speak your language. That area, you guys can stay. So the whole, whole army, Roman army, stayed there. And after that, they buried them. Of course, now it's a big city. And even now, every year they have a, they wear a Roman hat, in a Roman armor to do a, a celebration. Even, even today, yeah. So I think it's a very interesting story, so I decided to make that movie.